Melissa Wright Cup, Wright Cup Recruiting with a career cue for you. I have been giving several interactive workshops lately on various career topics, but one of my favorites is nurturing your network through informational interviews. And you might ask, why is this important to me? Well, I have shared the premise that we need to nurture all our networks, both personal and professional, throughout our lifetimes because we don't know um, when they're going to be valuable. And superficially, people call and ask you for things, and those are people that you don't necessarily want to help so much. But if you have genuine connections with people, um, you would be really surprised. My, my responsibility is to share with people the value of informational interviews and how they work in terms of improving your network. And so what I've done is I've had people learn about the purpose of informational interviews, which is to gather information about people and their careers and companies, but also to be able to share what they've done and how they might possibly add value to somebody. And through this give and take, um, they're sharing and learning, and we can identify gaps and where we meet those gaps. So that's one reason to do informational interviews. Another is this concept that I read about uh, by, it's called a ring of recipro reciprocity. Uh, Wayne Baker and Cheryl Baker and Adam Grant came up with it, and it's about asking for and giving help. And if we create a culture of giving, that we help each other. And I thought, that's fascinating. And then I spoke with a client of mine. A third reason to nurture the networks is that our friends and family, which are our inner circle, um, can be helpful and supportive, but that most referrals and most activity, maybe it's a panel presentation or delivering a workshop like I do or um, hearing about a job you don't know, come from second and third contacts. And what I mean by that are, colleagues or friends from work or um, your university or professional societies or people you've been referred to that you don't even know yet. So instead of sticking with those that you know and are true and tried people that you know, expand your horizons, step out of your zone of comfort, put down the fear and recognize that something new isn't bad and go out there and nurture those networks and expand them through informational interviews, and you have no idea what organically might come your way.